Hi everyone. Bundles Farmers Market. Today we are at the Bundle Farmers Markets. Right out the back of surfers. We've never been to these ones before. That's where you it. But the car park's pretty full. Free on the Sunday, which is good. It's a free parking. It's warm. It's a nice looking day. Let's do this. How about we go in this way? Hey, Bernice. Oh. See what they got? Apples. I don't know where they grow apples up here. Maybe Stanthorpe. But they're a cold climate food. Oh, this looks nice. Oh, look at. Pretty expensive. It's a problem with these farmers markets. Everything costs so much. Eggs. Jam. Egg, egg jam. Oh, yeah, that sounds good. Jam. Fresh dug up garlic. Well, what are they going to do? Sell it in the ground still? Yeah. Those uh, cucumbers look a bit worked over. Those bananas look a bit rough. They do look homegrown though. I saw somebody selling like nectarines, but five for six dollars. You can get them from Coles like ten for four dollars. So I reckon they just go to Coles, buy like ten, and then they come and sell them here and uh, make 40% on them. Bernice, Bernice, yeah. Eggplant. Nine ninety a kilo. Yeah. What's going on? And your farmers are always crying poor. They charge like ten bucks for some eggplant. Ah. This, this market's um, pretty big, isn't it? Yeah. Except everyone's just selling the same thing. It's all... Uh... There's a dinko! Um, they're all just selling the same fruit and veg. I think it's Oh, there's some olives. Bernice, there's some olives up there. Sam Bernice and she's good at grabbing free stuff. Oh, <laughs> have a nice trip. Okay, so this is the olives from Byron Bay Olive Company. Oh, it's mainly seeds. <laughs> Chewy. Interesting. Now I got a seed, but I got a toothpick too. Sweet. Love toothpicks. Beeswax. Honeycomb. Where? Yeah. Oh, yum. I love honeycomb. Put it in the ice cream. Mm. I love how chewy it is. Oh, seed grapes, white grapes, eight dollars. Mate, Coles has them for four ninety. Was it? No, yeah. no. The other shop, our fruit and veg shop, has them for two dollars ninety a kilo. Why would I pay twice as much? Almost to support the farmer. Well, that's why. But I won't. Okay. Well, that's nice. Yeah. Imagine that in your house, blowing steam out everywhere. Your shoes would go mouldy. Electronics would go Oh, there we go, 350 kilo, that's all right. How much did you pay yesterday? I paid 250 for a kilo and a half. Yeah. These guys selling newspapers. Oh, 
It still goes down there. Oh, this place is big. They got kombucha by the tap here. Fill your own bottle. What an acid free pineapple. Acid free? Oh no, they got samples though. Although, have they been eaten already? Yeah. They'd just be less acidic, I'm guessing. Acid free. Try one. Do you want one? Try some acid free. I prefer it with acid, of course. I'm not tripping out. I'm not tripping out from the acid. That's the same. It's missing something though, isn't it? It's missing the acid. Two for the two fifty each for those avos. It's two for five now. Three for six. That's a nice bulb of garlic. Acid free, man. The hippies won't be buying that. Emu Creek eggs. Cool. They're acidic. That's what we want, the acid ones. Yeah, man, let's trip out, man. So they have, uh, looks like a band set up here and like tables and food and everything and over here there's like people swimming in the uh, hopefully it's shark free I I'm guessing it would be I got bubbles blowing up oh mate what else is going on look at this we got bloody good pies sold here I bet they are too I bet they're very tasty look at all these other puffer jizz I don't even know what that says. Mum's crepes. Uh, the biggest scam in the world, sugar cane. How much is that? Six dollars a cup. Sugar cane costs what? Nothing. It's $1.50 in Singapore. Yeah. $1.50 in Singapore, we have to pay six dollars. Ah. We got an ATM machine, dispenser. What a six dollar sugar cane. <laughs> yeah, we need that. Yeah, if you want sugar cane juice, you'll need that. Don't know what they're building here. Maybe that's a, like a bungee jump or something. That's a, that's a ride. But yeah, it looks pretty good. It looks landlocked. Oh, it must be tidal. I can see a little drain through there where it must come through. Probably got grills there to stop the sharks coming through. But hey, there's like an amphitheater up here. Do you want to walk out there and have a look? Sure. Okay. This is the art center. The art center, I don't know. I've no idea. Let's go up here. These toilets are ambulant toilets. They look nice. Caution, steep trail, uneven surface. Ugh. Hard on the old knees too. Oh geez, nearly slipped. I should have been more cautious. Well, this, um, this pathway would have cost quite a bit. These rocks aren't cheap. But it's a beautiful native garden. Flowers. Flowers. <laughs> Should have a nice view up here. We can sit down up here on this rock and take in the sights. Lots of native trees and grasses. That is the art center. We got a grass tree here. We used to call them black boys. This 
garden is very overgrown. It needs Greg the gardener to come in, pull out some of this stuff. It's just way too much stuff in here. But there's uh, the back of Surface Paradise. Helicopter tour, tourist helicopters flying around. A Q1 here. I've got a seaplane up there. You've got the mountains to the south. And we've got this thing here. Let's have a look. I'm probably breaking the law. Yeah, it's a good place for concerts. Lots of space for people to sit and watch. Cool. So that must just slide across or something that will fold up. You got a nice stage there. It's nicely decorated, like with Aboriginal sort of themes. Very nice. Haven't been here before, so it's all new to me. Anyone want a coffee? Only $25. <laughs> hey, here's one that I could probably do. Well, I got a sausage sizzle for $2.50, so that's good. So I could sell burgers here. In a place like that. Hey, just get some free labor happening. And yeah, go for it. Free corn tasting. Normally, how much was it? Four dollars for a piece of corn on a stick, like a proper, proper size one. Just tastes like. Doesn't taste special, does it? Start your own corn thing at a market. Charge three bucks. Yeah. Anyway, I got another toothpick, so I'm happy. Yeah. It's pretty average corn. Lots of peaches and nectarines, plums, pears. Oh, there's some apple cider. Oh, that's juice. I thought it was apple cider vinegar. But lots of things to try and taste. I haven't had a piece of green apple for since Jesus was a boy. And that's why I don't, because I don't like green apples that much. They're really sour. You like the sour ones? Oh. Well, that's why they still sell them. I actually like the green over the red. Really? Yeah. What about pears? Do you like a pear? It depends. I like a nice pear. I like the soft one, not the crunchy one. Mm. Asian vegetables! Yay! Bernice is looking for the um, pointy spinach. Baby pointy spinach. Baby pointy spinach. Hmm. No. I can't see any baby pointy spinach. There was a plant shop down here though. They look pretty good. Lots of succulents. All the plants look very nice and healthy. Spathy films are flowering. Oh, these are nice. They're like a crow's nest sort of thing. But they grow in clumps. Oh, look, here's a ginger. 
bird's nest, $18. I can go to the rainforest and get some for free. Oh, hippie dresses. Hey. But yeah, no, lots of nice plants there. come to somewhere we didn't even buy any is this Southport Park no Southport something, Southport something. Uh, we didn't even buy any fruit or veg or anything from the markets but we have plenty of fruit and meat and things to eat but they got a good fruit and veg shop just down there which we'll go to late later but first we want to go inside some air conditioning because it's pretty warm. We just want to cool down a bit. Oh yeah, it is Southport Park. Yeah. Southport. All right, so inside here we got the Carls, we got the liquor land, yeah, whatever that is. A couple of shops, a reject shop, butchers. We got Woolies down the end. And this floor, which is the cleanest floor I've ever seen, it's like glistening. <laughs> but yep, right, we've done our shopping, picked up some bargains, time to go. Bernie's got her coffee, $1.30. Yum, how is it? Nice. You yeah? Try some? So. Haven't had one of those for a while. Okay, time to go. There's a fruit and veg shop out here that's good, so we'll go there. Oh, your shoes, Bernice. Oh, no. Bernice's shoes that she bought <laughs> broke. While we were walking around the markets, her shoes disintegrated. <laughs> the ones she paid $1.50 for at the markets. Yeah, well, damn it. Have to go and buy some more. 